Alrighty, hello. I keep trying to get out of the chair, but every time I do, Dusty gets back in my lap, so I guess we're going to be playing this for a little while longer. And I set the timer. Just before it told me to. Win. Not that it told me to, just before the thing popped up. Right, so I discovered, after watching the last video, that it was not a codex entry that popped up. It was a quest. <laughs> Malcolm Hawk found several demons inside this prison. One of them repeated a strange echo of his voice. Seek out other such demons. So, that sounds like a good thing to do. Curse. The coral fragment instead of money. I don't know why they were carrying that around. Privilege to the wardens. All we hear is that this is the one of the great Grey Warden's secrets. It must be protected at all costs. As usual, we're most concerned with deceiving our own people. But why hide that the deep roads were shaped not only by the dwarves, but also by us? I found records dating back to 1004 TE, the wake of the first blight. Early wardens discovered that some Darkspawn could think and speak and commanded portions of the Horde even after the Archdemon's death. A few could wield magic with the skill of a Tevinter Magister, and the Wardens greatly feared them. It was here, in the Vimark Mountains, that Warden Sasha Miri set her trap to ca capture and study the greatest of these creatures, the one whom they called Corypheus. Uh, I don't know if you saw me play that one bit of Origins, uh, but there was... A DLC, I think this is the way that I came from, uh, wherein you meet a, a smart and intelligent darkspawn, and he says that he's the only one that he ever found who uh, had sentience, so maybe he's not the only one. He ended up trying to raise other darkspawn to intelligence as well, using a Grey Warden blood. His name was the Architect. Alrighty. But yeah, so I wonder if there's any connection to the architect here. Oh, you're a person. They find it. The dwarves. I heard them. Looking. Digging. How do you bring the key here? You mean this? How is this a key? Magic. Old magic it is. Magic from the blood. It made the seals. It can destroy them. I came in here to find Corypheus. Do you know where or what he is? Do not say his name. He will hear you. Do not wake him. Not when you hold the key. Let me guess. You want to drink my blood too? Blood? The blood of the hawk? Are you the hawk? Yes. I smell magic on you. But you hold the key, the key to his death. Yes, I can show you out, yes. Who are you? What's wrong with you? You ask me that? I am the one who belongs here, not you. You are no dark spawn. That armor, it's warden issue. No one has that. You hear it, no? Hear it calling. I smell it in you. I know the way out. Follow me. Down and in. Down and in. <laughs> because I always like to follow the advice of tainted, crazy people. Not crazy. No. Trust me. I know the prison's secrets. The seals hold us in. Anything comes in. Nothing ever leaves. Not without the key. 
You must use it, yes. On the seals. Every seal. You touch the key to it. Only then they open. Only for the hawk. Not back. Not up. Only way out is down and through the heart. Down. Down. In the depths. Careful. Things down here. They can get complicated. You mean they're not already? I have a crazy person who is probably a warden who is trying to possibly wake up Corypheus or destroy Corypheus. I really couldn't tell. The Warden's Prison. The Grey Warden's Prison in the Vimark Mountains is believed to have been constructed more than a thousand years ago. The original method of construction has been lost to history, but the Warden Commanders of the Free Marches have maintained the prison's secret through the centuries. The prison is concealed in a great rift in the Vimark Mountains, far from any easily traveled mountain passes. The Wardens themselves have spread rumors of banditry and beasts to prevent explorers from approaching. The prison consists of a central tower built into the rift with magically maintained bridges allowing access at different levels. Each level is sealed by a blood magic ritual in which a mage of untainted blood uses his own life essence to create a magical barrier that is permeable from the outside, yet impenetrable from within. This one-way access has caused other darkspawn, and perhaps unwary travelers, to be caught within the prison's confines. Those who disappear inside never re-emerge. Yay. Found that note next to a pile of bones of someone who possibly went inside and never reemerged. I've tried to forget about this side of myself. Justice is so strong. Sometimes the wardens seem insignificant. But seeing that poor bastard brings it all back. The darkspawn taint. The call of the archdemon. It's inside me. As much a part of me as justice. Hmm, maybe. Tell me more. You should find someone else, love. You don't want all the ugliness I'm going to bring into your life. Nobody's perfect. I've got to hand it to you, Blondie. You make that work every time. <sighs> Jeez. Also, yes, I am playing this from a save before I beat the game. I... Oh, that doesn't look good. Is that a pride demon? That's a pride demon. <laughs> I'm gonna break the seal and have to fight a pride demon. Okay. Great. Let's, um... Have at it, shall we? <laughs> okay. Hi. Shoot, I turned off my shield. Oh, that was possible. <laughs> Completely the wrong button. Oh, jeez. Just exploded when it teleported. Get me healthy. Ow. It seems to be going remarkably well. It did go well. Let me guess. The first seal? Two thousand years the magic holds. Never broken. Give it the key. Let it take the magic back to itself. Absorb it. All who came before. So I get a bonus, but I have to choose which bonus. Electricity, nature, cold, or fire? Oh shoot, I didn't mean to click one. Oh well. I'm guessing it was lightning. The blood works. It is good. All this talk about my blood is a little creepy. Are you at least planning to tell me your name? Name? 
So long since I've said my name. Like, I... Lorias. I was Lorias. There was a, a title, too. Commander. Commander of the Grey. He was a warden. Poor wretch must have come down here on his calling. That's how it affects you. Yes, the calling. The songs get louder. Only death stops them. I am dead. But I never died. Anders? What are you talking about? Wardens aren't immune to the taint forever. In time, we start to hear voices. The same ones Darkspawn hear. Not exactly a hero's end, is it? I've opened the seal. Will the prison release me? There are more. Follow them in. All the way to the heart. Many locks. Only one key. Corypheus calls. In the darkness. What waits there? Okay. Well. That guy was fiery. So maybe the next one will be like... Cold I'm not listening. Or lightning. I'm not listening. Come on, Blondie. You're strong enough to overcome this. Oh, poor Anders. Oh, shoot. Oh, hi. You're a big boy. Yes. Shoot, I turned off my shield again. Seriously heavy looking shield. Indeed. Is there anything over here that I missed? I feel like I've been that way before. There's a pile of bones. Yep, looks like we got it. Anything over this way? Nope, rocks. Okay. Come on, y'all. Let's get that purse I was trying to pick up. So yeah, I, I wonder if it's going to be a different element I have to fight every time, in which case... There must be more seals ahead. In which case, I'm glad I didn't get the cold one, because I imagine that cold would have been good against fire, and we've already fought fire. Unless they're all fiery, in which case I should have gone for the cold damage. I don't imagine it really matters much. Okay... Down. Refuse's prison, Ferele's floor. That seems like a good place to hold off. Alright. <sighs> Alrighty. I suppose I will see you again next time.